Hello everybody and welcome to part 2 of my SOMA playthrough and I've just uh, gotten back into the game, I just reloaded this save game and there was actually one interesting thing on the loading screen, uh, the game actually kind of gave me a very limited like summary of the latest thing that has happened because it, it basically told, I'm going to put this in like an overlay um, it basically told me Simon found the multi-tool and he's now able to open certain doors, which I think is pretty nice, especially if you are somebody who doesn't play through a game in kind of like uh, one go. So you, you're playing this on and off and maybe with a few days. Um, a few days between episodes or between uh, plays and you kind of like forget what it was that happened uh, last time you played it so I think this I it's I think it's a good idea to actually give the player kind of like a like feedback what it is that he's just recently managed to achieve Okay, so far so good. I think we have to go back here. So I was able to put the toolbox chip, I think it was, into the um, uh, into the multi-tool, and I'm now able. I'm now able to open this, but first, before I go through here. I want to have a look at this. What? Where am I? What is this? Where does it? Oh, what the heck! Wow, I went all the way around here. Uh, oh, I could have just gone the other way and would have been much quicker. Okay, that's good to know. Okay, we are definitely underwater. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Right, so... How we got here, I have no idea, but <laughs> we're probably going to find out what the f... What the f... That is a shark, I suppose. Like nothing happened, everything still looks the same, all silence alike. Okay. Why do all these fish have the, like these weird tentacles coming out of them? What is that? And again, fish with tentacles back and different, a thick structure gel they can't shake. W A use freaky fishes. Okay. Right. Okay, so they deliberately um, abandoned this station, I guess. And it, uh, the people in this voice message said Upsilon, which is probably the station's name, is a power plant. Okay, this is open. I guess I'll have to leave this open. Um. 
doesn't really say what's up ahead. Oh, security is up ahead. What's that? Okay. Okay, I guess I'll have to go through here. Yeah, that's not... I don't have a flashlight yet. Guess I'll be picking that up sometime. Robot assembly, okay. Well... There was a short freeze right there. And we are crawling through this. Okay, s guess something hostile. Just went through this through this vent or whatever this is. Uh, can I? Okay, this doesn't open. Guess I'll have to go the other direction then. Station control. Okay, we are above station control, I guess. Or underneath? I don't know. I guess we're above it actually. Station control. Okay, this looks more like it. Yeah. Station control. Oh, this is the place from the gameplay trailer, I think. Yeah, I actually I saw the the gameplay trailer and it basically started off right here. That's cool. Don't touch the strut gel leakage can't confirm its effect on WAU. Ishi has been reported to SSE worker... Uh, or no, not worker. SSE wall check. Okay. It's actually a name. Okay. Hey, can you hear me? Okay, I guess not... There's no other way for me to do this. I need it. Why? I was okay. I was happy. Okay. Um, maybe I killed somebody just now. I don't know. Well, it's a robot. So I don't feel that guilty. Manual. Boot sequence, okay. Okay, I guess I'll have to wait until it hits green. Okay. Okay, so we have brought the facility back to life, it seems. I guess that's going to bring about some unwanted attention, however. Terminal locked. Oh, what is. What, what's happening? Hello, is there anyone there? Hey, hey, can you hear me? I hear you. Uh, Absalot, what's going on? Uh, I, I have no idea. I, I just sort of woke up here. In the room right now? Uh, it, it, was, it was like a, a seat with a helmet. Is that right? Uh, what's your name? I, I'm Simon Jarrett. And what do you... Oh, so, oh, damn, you Where are you now? 
uh, 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 some place dealing with electrical power. I I'm not sure if it's a plant or a transformer. Uh, yeah, you're probably in the thermal plant somewhere. You want to go upstairs to the comm center. It's the room with the dome ceiling. Uh, hey, look, look, this place is not... There's something seriously wrong here. Hello? I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. We lost another relay. Just listen, head for the comm center upstairs. I'll wait here. Great, okay. Wow. That looks amazing. Wow, wow, wow. They have really upped the graphical prowess of the uh, of the graphics engine with Soma. Epsilon standard system 2. Is that 2017 or is that 2.017? I think. I guess it's 2000 bar. Oxygen unavailable. Station diagnosis uh, unavailable. Recorded downtime, 143 days, okay. Structure, inner, inner hall, integrity, multiple breaches, base structure, subcoat, mine of perforation, armor, abandoned. Okay. Guess the site isn't really in the best shape. Okay. So we've got a turbine right here that's powering the entire thing here I guess if I had to assume okay I can't crawl through here but I might be able yeah or or not oh there's something coming Okay, I have no idea what that thing was. <laughs> I don't want to find out. I fortunately I shut that thing up, that door, so the thing, whatever it was, couldn't actually get to us. Lockdown process initiated. Check terminal for details. Okay. Log in. Okay, I need some kind of. Whoop! I need some kind of login code. Hmm. Oh, these are. <laughs> These are health stations, or what are they? I guess so. It doesn't hurt anymore. Yeah, it doesn't hurt anymore. <laughs> okay, some more weird uh, sketches. What the heck is that? That's so weird. Is that kind of like an alien? I don't know. It doesn't li seem like it's from our world. Got sheep? Question mark. 
W A U. What is a W A U? Oh, what amazing! Amy and Carl pa in Pathos bodies. Okay, Amy and Carl. Okay. I think we heard those names a couple of times. What are you? Are you blind? It's me, Carl. Carl Semke. Wrangler. Any of this sound familiar to you? I know, actually. Well, thanks for being so helpful. It's not like I'm knocked out on the floor or anything. Well, you are. Are you human? Shit. Did, did my body give it away? I try hard to stay a mystery. Yeah, I'm human. Are you? Uh, my name is Simon. Do you know anything about this place? Oh. You knew. That makes us slightly less weird. Look, I'm obviously hurt. If you see anyone else around, just tell them where I am. So, where are you, exactly? Are you for real? I'm right here. See me waiting? Look at my hands. Hey, buddy! Okay, okay, I, I'm, ju I'm just gonna be... I, I'm not seeing it. I, I see a machine, a robot talking. What the hell are you looking at? I'm here! See? Okay. I, I just didn't expect you to look like that. You really hung up on appearances, you know that? How did you hurt yourself? Not sure. Blacked out pretty bad. Can't remember how I got here. What do you remember then? I was in the pilot seat, promoting a UH. UH? A universal helper. You know, a robot like these things, but livelier. Anyway, I was just dealing with some heat shields and... That's my last clear memory. You were remote controlling a robot. We do it all the time. Robots are too on a way to deal with some stuff. Intuition doesn't grow on motherboards, you know. Did you maybe get trapped in the robot somehow? Your mind is pretty tightly wired to the helper, but nah, pretty far-fetched. Listen, I don't want to alarm you, but I think you might be trapped in a robot. I'm telling you, get your eyes checked. I'm right here. I see both my hands, both my feet. When you remote, all you see is like a video feed from the helper unit. Your own body is entirely out of the picture. If you see any others, just let them know where I am. Okay, so how do we do this? Okay, I guess. I can't move. Please. I I'm sorry. I I yeah. think I pulled the wrong lever. Oh, don't sweat it. Just get me a doctor. Okay, so that's not the thing to do. The other cable goes through here. I think we nearly <laughs> killed Carl here. Warning. Offline. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't sweat it, pal. Okay, so where the heck do I go? What is this? Workshop? That sounds good. Okay. Something happened here. I'm still not sure what the heck happened. That guy or that robot thinks he's a human when he's clearly trapped in a robot. I wonder. I mean, we can't see our limbs anymore, but we saw our limbs when we woke up. But maybe we were also put into a robot? I mean, who the hell knows? Oh god, he's dead? He's dead. Carl Semken, okay. 
0722 Yeah, call your dead pal What is up here? Oh, I can actually go... Okay, no, I can't. Okay, I'll have to be careful here because I know <laughs> from the gameplay trailer that the next enemy is not far off. W-A-U. I uh, still have no idea what W-A-U stands for. Okay, that was 0722. Access to comm center via stairs... What? To comm center, okay. Access to comm center via stairs. Yeah, I, I misread that. <laughs> Okay, O seven two two mail. Okay, Volchek, hello. Absolute auto process power reduction has been secured. We've sealed off the factories to keep the plant running. All superflu systems have been turned off. If anyone ever has to return, know that the power flow regulator is hanging on by a thread. If you flip the switch, it's probably a no turning back situation. Okay. Okay, that was never sent off actually that message. Oh, okay. So should shut down one of the highlighted sections to divert power to the communication center. Okay, this is where Carl is, isn't it? And we cannot shut this one off uh, without actually killing him. We could check out this one right here, though. Storage. Okay. Sam Wrangler, Sam can call Azaro Amy Field Service Technicians. Okay, Absalom Control Deck Shuttle Station. Alright. Okay. Okay, I can't open this. Okay, I'm going to try and talk to Carl. Don't a mechanic make more sense? You're trying to be fucking funny? Give me a medic! But you're a robot! Really? The robots have legs, hands, a face! You're delusional! Okay, calm down. I, I won't- Get some fucking help! Go tell the others! Hmm. Alright. Let's move on down the hall. Let's see if we can do something right here. Flow control, okay. Read this. We strain the system. If you pull the lever, there's no turning back. Make sure you want it bad enough. Oh, uh, yeah, I think so. Okay. That should do it. Oh, 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 that's that's our friend from before, I think. OK, 
Okay, he's coming. He's a coming. Or not. What the heck is he doing? He's weird. He's really weird. Is he? Okay, well he's right in the door. Okay. Oh my God. Okay, what we have to do, I think, is get back to the computer terminal and put back the power on the control center and then, or the comm center, the comm center, then pull the lever and get up the stairs. Come on! Oh, he's coming back. Bastard. And close as shit. Oh yeah. And Ooh. okay, we got rid of him again. Do I even need this? Partial data recovery successful. Josie has an evac coming along. We've got everything we need to move, but we can't leave the plant without supervision. Adams decided to leave Amy, Asaro, and Kalsanka to execute the automatization process. And I bet they're thrilled about it. I just wanted to let you know we're on schedule and I'll talk to you tomorrow. All right, I'll pass on the ball check. Josie, nothing going for an evac, am I right? It will do. I wanted to introduce you to Amy and Carl. They'll be doing the talking as soon as I leave for Theta. Say hello. Hey, Theta. Hello. Hey, guys. I'm Peter Strauss, King Dispatcher at Theta. Just let me know if there's anything I can do to help. I suppose that's it. I'll see you real soon. When we arrive. All right, Johnson. Have a safe trip. Hey. Hello, Theta. Absalom. 
What's up? We could really use direct contact with Heather. Uh, I mean, uh, site service engineer Wolchek. Direct links are almost impossible to establish. The Lumar relays are basically junk at this point. You could send messages via the comm center. If you want, I'm pretty much always here, ready to relay anything by hand. I, I know it's a shitty system, but it's all that works right now. All right, we just have to make two. Catch you later. Hello? Peter, was it? Yeah, I'm here. What's up? We're getting out. I just want to tell you that I'm going to seal the comm center now, so this is definitely the last you'll hear from us. If we don't show up in the next couple of hours, send in the cavalry. Hang on, what's happening? It's still the same plan, right? Yep. We'll head for the shuttle and ride it directly to Theta. Okay, good. I'll rally the troops for a welcome party. <laughs> they like to hear. Okay, well, Carl and Amy... Well, Carl definitely never made it out of here. As you could see... New York status offline. John City office is closing down and everyone is being evacuated from everyone here. I want to say it's been an honor working with you and Upsilon. Godspeed and good luck with the apocalypse. Oh, where exactly is Upsilon? Lisbon, Maine. Update on the defense measurements. Final efforts by the global community to prevent collision has failed. Pathos 2 should make any final efforts to deal with the inevitable wake following impact. Estimated time for impact 0513. What kind of impact? London, offline. Dear Miss Victis Johnstotter, it's with great sadness I have to inform you that the office will close and no longer support Upsilon and Pathos 2. I would like to take this opportunity to thank you, your supervisor Jane Adams and the rest of the staff. You are a terrific group and it's with great confidence I say that where we fall you will surely carry on with bravery. Hadith Auxiliary John C, I know you have a much better chance for survival but we have the better view. <laughs> uh, there is actually some humor right there. Okay. Right. Hey, are you there? I found the dome ceiling. Oh, that's better. Simon, was it? Uh, Jared, Simon Jared. Hi, Simon. I'm Catherine. Have you figured out what's going on yet? Me? I was hoping you'd have some answers. I probably have some. What do you want to know? Where to even begin? I mean, what is this place? How did I get here? And, and why do the robots talk like they're people? Well, you're at Upsilon, clearly. Have you never been there before? Where did you work? The Grimoire in Toronto. Is that really important? No, I mean, where did you work at Pathos 2? I don't know what that is. That's unexpected. Did you come directly from Toronto? Yeah, I did. And it was very unexpected. Have you seen any people? Like, staff or field technicians? Only robots. Crazy ones. This is also strange. You're telling me. What was that? No! What's going on? I think this place is about to collapse. What do I do? Simon, come to Lambda. Uh, how, how do I get there? There are shuttle trains connecting all the sites. Find one and come here. I'll wait for you. Oh. Uh. Shit, shit, shit. Where do I? Where should I? Oh, fuck. Okay. 
Okay. Am I dead? I guess not. I hope not. Okay. Now I'm... Now... What? On the water. What the hell? How is this possible? Okay, yeah, we're clearly not what we think we are, I guess. Uh, oh, okay, so I have to climb out there. Okay, but anyways, I'm going to stop the episode here. And it's been a very thrilling ride so far. It's, it's really n interesting how this is going to continue. And we've already made contact with at least one crazy robot. And... What the heck is going on? Yeah. I don't know, I had some weird... <laughs> I had some very weird load screen pop up there. Okay, anyways. Um, okay, this is it for part two of my summer playthrough. I hope you enjoyed this episode and I'll see you guys in the next one.